Back a Frederick County family is fighting to bring more awareness to ALS through their own personal story. Frederick County reporter Skylar Salas brings us more. Hi, I'm April, and this is my husband, Bill, and we live in Frederick, Maryland. I am 42 years old and was diagnosed with a terminal illness known as the LS at Johns Hopkins. Back in December of 2022, April and her family learned the news that she was diagnosed with amyotrophic lateral sclerosis. Her husband, Bill, says they started noticing April having mobility issues that got worse over time. That's when the Hopkins neurologist said, Have, has anybody talked to you about the possibility of ALS? And at the time, it was still a po possibility. And that's scary to hear because it's, there's no cure for it. ALS is a nervous system disease that weakens the muscles and impacts physical function. In April's case, it also caused her to have respiratory failure, but she was determined to make it. I am currently on a ventilator and have a feeding tube, making every day a challenge. Despite the difficulties I face, I am determined to keep fighting for my family and be there for my children. Since learning of her diagnosis, the Kerners have received help from their community to try and balance their new normal. Trying to take little things off our plate that uh, they can. Um, they, they, we, we've received help with that, uh, which little things like that mean a lot and it goes far. Now their biggest struggle is finding a way to continue the help they have. But in the end, the Kerners hope their story will bring more awareness to ALS and create more help for those affected. It does affect everybody because it doesn't just affect her, it affects the families as well. My hope for the future is to get additional help and for there to be a cure for ALS. Reporting in Frederick, Maryland, Skylar Salas, DC News Now.